Hello, I'm Lee Scaridi with Microchips Applications Team. I'd like to introduce you to our newest PIC12, PIC16F15XX family member, our lowest cost and smallest part with I2C, the PIC12LF1552. This new device is based on our highly efficient enhanced mid-range core and features a memory footprint of 3.5 kilobytes for code and 256 bytes for data. It also has advanced analog to digital conversion on up to four input sources as well as two-way communication using only two wires for a very efficient utilization of all its pins. This device is the perfect choice for a variety of market segments, including consumer electronics, medical, automotive, home appliance, just to name a few. As mentioned, the PIC12 LF1552 features microchips enhanced mid-range architecture, which offers higher performance, C-friendly code development, low features, efficient code execution, a 16-level hardware stack and a program counter, among other enhancements. This device also offers a 10-bit analog-to-digital converter with hardware capacitive voltage divider support. This provides automated capacitive touch sampling, which reduces code size and decreases CPU usage. So this device can not only handle standard analog to digital conversion for applications with temperature, light, or pressure sensing, but will also make the implementation of M-Touch applications like keypads, sliders, or proximity detectors much easier. In addition, the PIC12LF1552 offers an I2C communication peripheral, providing applications with the flexibility to either control several devices like LCD displays or real-time clocks, or to exchange with a host system for status reporting or application configuration and calibration, for example. Here is an example of one of many utilizations of this small PIC microcontroller. We've designed an application with a keypad using four touch buttons, so four pins out of eight. We've also wanted to demonstrate that this small device could manage multiple I2C components. So we've added a display capability to our application to allow interaction with the user. With this, we wanted the application to display ambient temperature. We decided therefore to add a temperature probe. Finally, challenging the MCU with a little more processing, we've also added a real-time clock device. The management of these three items only uses two wires or pins of the MCU, making the application utilize all six available MCU pins. So here is a demonstration board with the four touch buttons and the display. We can see that the application's hardware uses very little components. In this area, we have our microcontroller unit. This area here holds the temperature sensor, while in this area, we have the real-time clock component. So here is how the board operates. This button, when pressed, will activate the display of button state data. When held for about two seconds, it activates and locks on a mode where we can see the actual shift or sensitivity on each pressed button. This button will activate and display the ambient temperature in degree Celsius and in degree Fahrenheit. The next button will activate the clock mode and display the current date and time. Finally, this button will activate the automatic mode where the application will cycle through all the previous display modes. For more information about the PIC12 LF1552 or any of our other 8-bit offerings, please visit us at microchip.com. Thank you.